For many years, petroleum-based sealers were the standard for attempting to preserve asphalt surfaces. But thanks to soybean checkoff funding, research has yielded a soy-based asphalt sealer and preservation agent called Replay. Containing 30% soybean oil, Replay penetrates and rejuvenates asphalt by replacing light oils that have oxidized out, along with reintroducing polymers to strengthen and renew pavement. It reduces water permeability by over 95%, is made in America with recycled materials and no foreign oil, and is completely non-toxic. Joe Kindler is owner of Ohio Pavement Systems and began using the product in 2005. On this day, he was on the campus of Michigan State University, applying replay to an asphalt parking lot at the Crop and Soil Science Research Facility. Advantages of replay versus other petroleum-based materials is its setup time. The material sets up within 30 minutes, open to traffic, maintains skid resistance. DOTs throughout the United States have skid tested it, ODOT in particular, and it maintains skid resistance, so there's no safety concern there. The material's bio-based, 88% bio-based uh, manufactured, so it has a, I guess you would say, a negative carbon footprint, which is a good thing compared to the petroleum materials, because it requires less energy and less time to set up and less resources because we use recycled materials. Uh, the replay material is good for anywhere from three to five years, extending the service life of asphalt and can be reapplied. Uh, you can see in the parking lot over here, the section that's been treated. Uh, some areas have striping. The other benefit of the replay material, when you put it over striping, it doesn't reduce the reflectivity or the service life of the striping as well, and you do not have to re-stripe. According to the United States Geological Service, coal tar-based seal coat, a product marketed to protect and beautify asphalt pavement, is a potent source of aromatic hydrocarbons to air, soils, streams and lakes, and homes. A recent study by Baylor University and the USGS indicates that living adjacent to coal tar sealed pavement is associated with significant increases in estimated excess lifetime cancer risk and that much of the risk occurs during early childhood. Some of the school districts around the Columbus, Ohio area will not use coal tar uh, materials at asphalt sealers because of these reasons. So they're being proactive in using something, uh, whether it be an asphalt based sealer or something such as a replay material. And the replay material is not uh, petroleum material, it's bio-based, so you don't have these hydrocarbons or these carcinogens. Um, there's no uh, ill effects of the material being used on that, so it doesn't leach off into the environment or cause uh, any environmental issues. Today, soy oil's market share as an edible product is around 70%, so there's room for exploration for the use of the remaining 30. To help with that, the United Soybean Board teamed up with Biospan Technologies in Missouri, who came up with Replay, benefiting soybean farmers with a new demand for their versatile crop. And the Michigan Soybean Checkoff Program is doing their part as well. We've decided to do some research on the oil. How can we use the oil in its form or in its processed form or in, in, in making this product uh, other than vegetable oil. So the National Checkoff, the United Soybean Board, funded this project. How we're using the state checkoff dollars is to make the product known, show demos. Hopefully the university will see this and just think of the volume that this university or other universities, uh, how about private enterprise, the Walmarts, the Kmarts, the Sam's Clubs of the world, could use this material as a bio-based material for preserving the asphalt and extending the life of the asphalt. Word continues to spread about the performance of replay on roadways, pathways, and parking lots, and opportunities are available for applicators in Michigan right now. For more information, contact Joe Kindler at opsinc.net. Find out more about the product itself at replay.biospantech.com and learn more about the work of the Soybean Checkoff Program at michigansoybean.org.